Unexpected change, victory is yours. Somebody sees, somebody is selfish. Okay, and there's evidence. Ooh, somebody's gonna get caught and busted because there's evidence on something. But there'd be an unexpected change that somebody was being selfish and in it for themselves. Somebody could be investigating this situation. Virgo, this, I said Virgo. Well, this is gonna be a full moon reading in Virgo, and that's what Virgos are all about getting down to the bottom of the business, being that perfectionist, every single little detail, being very analytical. So, for this full moon reading for the sign of Virgo, we're going to see what's coming up for whichever sign it is that I find. I just did Virgo. We at Cancer. Cancer. So let's see what this full moon in Virgo has to come to light for you guys. What's been hidden? What's been going on? Who's been secretly investigating you? What's been go what do you need to investigate a little more in? Spend time on perfecting, whether it be in your love life, your professional life, your work life, whatever. Let's just see on my end what comes up for you guys, Cancers. Cancers. Uh, as I hop into this reading, please, 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 please be mindful and keep in mind that these are general readings from my perspective, from what my spirit guides tell me, okay? These are not personal readings, so don't take it personal. Again, this is a general reading. Take what fits, leave the rest, all right? Parts of this reading may not resonate to your liking, and that's okay. That does not mean it will not resonate with somebody else. Just because it's not for you does not mean it's not going to be for the next one. All right? Take what fits. Leave the rest. Try any other reading in your sun, moon, rising, or Venus sign. Or any other reading I post with a title that resonates or sticks out to you is possibly a message in that reading for you. Okay? Also, be mindful to flip-flop the roles in the energy according to your situation. I could be saying you, it could be them, I could be saying she, it could be a he. I could be saying it's your mama, it could be your lawyer, it could be your doctor, it could be your mentor, it could be your dog, it could be whoever, okay? You make it fit. If it does not fit, though, you cannot make it fit no how, no way, leave it, okay? I'm not forcing you to embody this reading, so you should not. You know your shoe size, Okay, I don't. So if the shoe don't fit, don't fucking force your foot in there. Because you're going to get bunions, and then you're going to try to come and blame it on me. No, that's not my problem. Okay? I'm not holding a gun to your head telling you to force you to watch this, and this is what's going to happen. No, if it resonates, it resonates. All right? If it brings you com confusion, leave it at the door. There are plenty of other good readers out there, and there's also a lot of shitty readers out there. So use your discernment once again on who to listen to and who not to listen to. Because we're adults, okay? At the end of the day, we still have to think for ourselves. Cancers. I almost called y'all Pisces. Y'all yeah, may be dealing with a Pisces or you may have Pisces in your chart. But there's a lot of false accusations about somebody cheating or creeping. Regardless of the fact, somebody's going to get caught as well too. Because somebody's also investigating the situation. Whether somebody's going to get caught lying or somebody's going to get caught cheating. Okay? Or trying to cock block. I'm here with some of you guys. Somebody been trying to cock block, whether it's you or somebody else. All right. Cancers. Really quick reading. I'm only going to get one card from each of these decks. So two cards came out. So distant horizon. So somebody. Y'all seen that messages and signs coming that I didn't. That was just being held right there. It's about to be a message of concern from somebody. And it's going to leave somebody in despair. Somebody's about to be in despair over some type of communication that is about to come in. Whether it be text messages, DM, email, phone call, letter, whatever. Somebody's going to be in despair when they get this communication. Alright, I'm going to just keep going. Before I go that deep, I'm a so this situation could be surrounding children. Yeah, but you, some of you guys are gonna get a reconciliation with a true love. Okay, so be very soon, clearly decide what you want. Cause I feel like somebody's gonna get caught cheating. 
Because clearly decide what you want. It's like somebody is indecisive. They got two different options. So they need to decide what they want. Because you got a true love that's coming. And it's going to be a reconciliation. For some of you guys, you got a reconciliation on the line. And you got a true love on the line. Some of you guys could be thinking about going to somebody from your past. Or whoever this is that show true love. I don't know. But you need to decide what it is that you want. Because somebody's a little indecisive right now. And somebody could be getting caught. So be mindful of that. Whatever this is, too, because you could be dealing with somebody and you could have money tied in with this person. So you have the ability to in instantly manifest abundance by choosing powerfully positive words. Always describe your own and the world's economic situation in loving and optimistic terms. And that is what you attract for yourself and others. Okay, now, so now I'm, some of you guys I'm hearing, you, like I said, you got money tied in with somebody. And this person could be helping you a lot, especially with what's going on in the world right now. Inflation, okay? And whatever this person does for work, they help you a lot. So you could be a little stressed out. Because um, either they help you a lot or they're not helping you a lot. And this other person can help you a lot. However it goes. So it's like somebody debating on what can I do. Because I could instantly have some type of abundance if I make the right decision. But what decision is it is that I'm going to make? Or did I F up this decision or this moment or this pathway? by doing something that I wasn't supposed to do. Now, for some of you guys, I caught you right at the nick of the time and you're not going to make no hasty decision and you're going to let it just, like, blow over and the right one going to come to you. You're going to see exactly what it is. Uh, don't be dropping your draws too easy right now. I'm going to say that because somebody could be dropping the draws to somebody and they can get attached and they can be like, oh, you're mine. And you're going to be like, no, but I got another option. And then they're going to be calling you hoes and whores and all this other stuff. And it's going to mess with your self-confidence and it's going to mess with your ego and it's going to stop you, your flow with things. Okay. So be mindful of that. And some of you guys got children with somebody. So you feel obligated. Or some of you guys are scared of a pregnancy. That's what I'm saying. So it could be like a child that could even be coming about in this situation. You don't want to have kids. Wrap it up or don't drop your draws too soon. What's really going on? This could even be a baby's father, baby's mother that you are like, I don't even know. You're indecisive. I still, I'm only a little confused. Do I stay? Do I go? The hangman in reverse. You're having a hard time. It's like somebody's having a hard time to, to surrender to something, to like trying to get a different perspective with what's going on, how it could be any better, how it could get any better. Somebody kind of knows too with this hangman that they kind of like did it to themselves, like you kind of like walked into this trap, but it happened this way so you, you can get enlightened, but somebody's having a hard time. It's like somebody is having a hard time learning from their lessons. In their past mistakes. You are them. I really don't know. Somebody could even be a little in denial. Not wanting to accept some type of responsibility. If I did not already say that. Like the role that they played in the situation as well too. We got four of wands to creating some type of instability in the situation. You may feel like it's off balance. That there's no peace and harmony. The situation is unstable. You may not want a reconciliation. Or you may feel like wherever it is that you are in right now. It's just off balance and unstable. Like there's no peace in this relationship. This foundation or this home no more. But spirit is trying to tell you something. Okay, your spirit, guys, is trying to get you to move the calmer waters. I don't know if this is with a reconciliation or this is moving on to somebody different. You got to be your own judgment when it comes to that. Ten of Swords, it's like you hurting yourself. But this is like a major... It's not only you hurting yourself. Somebody could be overindulging too much, too, with this song way too gone on the background, whether it's you or them, to the point that they say and do a lot of nasty, evil, hurtful things. Um, or things that they regret. Maybe somebody got overly overly indulged and stepped out. And they was like, damn, I wasn't supposed to do that. But this is like a major betrayal. A harsh ending, a bad ending. Somebody's like, yeah, this is the max. How did you hurt me like that? I'm hearing somebody's very hurt. But they feel like, so they feel like it, it's just best that they leave this in the past. To focus on their public recognition or success. Or somebody feels like this time was the last time. Because the public seen. A lot of people seen what happened. 
with some of you guys, you feel like your public, your your reputation is on the line as well too. When it comes to this, somebody feels like they damaged their reputation. We got the Ace of Cups, Eight of Ace of Cups, Eight of Pentacles in Reverse, and then the Lovers. So, same energy. Somebody's indecisive. That's that Two of Wands because, like, look, it's a new beginning here, but somebody. Okay, it can go so many ways. There could be a new beginning that's here because somebody don't want to work on this soulmate connection. Or there's a new beginning because you see what you in is just not working out no more. And you ready for your real soulmate. If that makes sense. This could be a new person and this could be your true love which could be somebody from your past. But we got something's not working out. It's like we got a soulmate and we got a twin flame. Is that what they call it? And this ace of cups could be your twin flame. Or it could be this the lovers. No, the lovers could be your twin flame. It can go any way because the lovers is like a choice that needs to be made as well too. Okay, it's a choice that needs to be made because somebody's indecisive. There's a choice that needs to be made because something's not working out. That's all I, I'm going to just leave it at that, Spirit. Thank you. I'm going to leave it at that. There's a choice that needs to be made because something's not working out. And it could be surrounding a child or a new love or because you got children. And then my daughter just came in. So for some of you guys, it's your only could be children. Somebody needs to have the courage and the strength to move forward. You could even be dealing with a Leo or have Leo on your chart. With the lovers, it could be a Gemini in here. Could be a Taurus in here. The, another Taurus in here with the higher fan. This could be dealing with a marriage or a commitment. Somebody's having a hard time settle down. Yeah. Somebody's having trouble with the marriage life. Somebody wants to be free. Uh, which one? I did all of those. What's going on, my cancers? Some of you guys that could be dealing with something with work as well, too. Somebody trying to doppelgang somebody. If somebody getting found out about, we got authorities that popped out. Big time messed up. Damn. Believe. So do it all. Just have some type of confidence. With somebody trying to force somebody to be perfect in the situation to the point that somebody was doing anything and everything to try to please somebody. Even some things that they shouldn't have been doing. Yeah, and somebody found out that somebody really was in it for themselves. You need not to be. They could even have anger issues. Somebody could have been trying to impress the wrong person. Trying to keep up. Somebody was trying to keep up. And keeping up get, got somebody in trouble. It's time to let it go. And we got Taurus. That says Taurus. It's, I know I'm going to have to. Yeah, but somebody is heavily protected. It could be dealing with a, a, false, a fake account as well, too. And look, and then we got that reunion card. So it's like somebody betrayal. Okay, I don't know how to feel about this. So somebody's been having a fake account as possibly somebody else, whether it be a social media account or a bank account, some type of fake accounts. Fake accounting or something or not taking accountability. And we got to need you. And we got that celebration. Okay, that could be that six of wands. They're trying to harm you. What's really going on with my cancers? Somebody could be lying and saying that they did something to try to bring a celebration about. But in actuality, they seen that they were doing it to try to harm somebody else. Like you wasn't the only one. They could have had somebody on the side. Or somebody that they was with. And you could have had somebody as well too. Somebody's jealous as fuck, and somebody has knowledge about that. Pay attention. Somebody was trying to bring blockages and disturbances. The ambition and time is now, because somebody is self-made, and somebody sees that. Somebody, like, going back to I said, somebody could have been in the wrong competition. I'm not saying that somebody could have been trying to be in competition with somebody, in the wrong competition with somebody, or trying to keep up in the wrong way. You guys could have an aunt or uncle that was involved in this situation, trying to force somebody to do something. 
And we got Leo could be in here in the near future. The devil toxicity. Using your kids to get back at you. Somebody could be your friend of me or yours. Somebody could even be a narcissist. Ooh, that car flew up. And we got the emperor. This could be a father. So somebody was trying to use, like, somebody, some kids to get back at them. I said it already. I thought, yeah, open your eyes, juggling. Or the way that they took care of kids. Or parents. And we got a Gemini in here with a wondering eye. Somebody could be on the cusp of Cancer and Leo or, or Gemini and Cancer. Yeah, somebody is toxic, okay? You could be dealing with a Gemini that's, like, just toxic as hell. Yeah, open your eyes. Somebody bullshit. It's a lot of bullshit surrounding this. It's, somebody fucked up, though. Look, dealing with social media, all right? Yeah, somebody fucked up with these fake accounts. That's all I'm going to say. And, and they see that nowadays. Getting involved with whatever they got involved with. Because it could be like, yeah, the authorities involved now. In the near future, look, somebody's money hungry, scheming and scamming. Do you. When somebody's actually secretly crushing and wanting you bad, start now. We got Taurus once again, but bread crumbing you. I'm only yours. So you got somebody that's self. Somebody gonna get arrested as well too. <sighs> so somebody secretly they want somebody, but I don't know if they could have this person. And on top of that, somebody didn't fucked up by trying to keep up with whatever it is that they tried to keep up with social, socially. All right. I love you guys so much. Take care.